हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अ ब्रांड न्यू चैप्टर कॉल अस स्टडी ऑफ गैस लॉ नाउ सिंस दिस चैप्टर डील्स विद लॉज रिगार्डिंग गैसेस सो इट बिकम्स एसेंशियल फॉर अस टू अंडरस्टैंड मोर अबाउट गैसेस सो फर्स्ट वी आर गोइंग टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज गैस गैस इज एक्चुअली द स्टेट ऑफ मैटर इन व्हिच द इंटर पार्टिकल अट्रैक्शन इज वीक एंड इंटर पार्टिकल स्पेस इज सो लार्ज दैट द पार्टिकल्स बिकम completely free to move randomly in the entire available space and this state of matter is what we call as gas now since we know now what is a gas let us try and understand more about its properties that is properties of gases very first property states that the gaseous substances or gases they have no definite shape or volume that is they can shape take the shape of container in which they are kept or even change their volume according to that second property states that gases have high compressibility now when we say high compressibility that means these gaseous substances can be compressed very easily the third property states that they exert pressure in all direction the reason for the same is since we know that there are three states of matter solid liquid and gases and out of the three states of matter we know for sure that the gaseous particle have highest amount of energy in them now owing to that highest amount of energy these particle are going to move and when they move they exert pressure that is why we say that gaseous substances they exert pressure in all directions next property states that gases have low density that is the reason why we say that gaseous substances or gases are lighter in weight the next property states that they are diffusible that is the property of diffusibility or miscibility now by diffusibility or miscibility we mean they have tendency to mix well as we can see over here that if you are going to take two gases and if you allow them to mix well they are going to mix well reason is because both the substances are gaseous in nature gaseous substances have highest order of energy and if they have highest order of energy they are going to move and when they move in some or the other random manner they get mixed well hence they are highly diffusible in nature or gaseous substances have certain properties which differentiate them from solids or even liquids for example let us consider the shape we all are already aware that solids have definite shape reason is because solids have strong intermolecular force of attraction owing to that the particles cannot move and their shape remains fixed whereas if we are talking about liquids liquid they do not have definite shape but they do have definite volume why because they take the shape of the container hence no definite shape but the amount always remains the same so the volume is fixed whereas if we are talking about gases gases do not have a definite shape or volume while solids and liquids have definite volume gases you or gaseous substances usually take the shape or volume of the container in which it is kept reason is because the gases have weak force of attraction between each other these gaseous molecule the reason hence they do not have definite shape or volume gas molecules are also said to be tiny particles moving in all direction and occupy the entire space owing to that highest amount of energy that is possessed by them now the molecule of a gas move in a straight line undergo random collision with other molecule as we can see over here and occupy the complete space available in the container unlike solids and liquids that is why we say that if we take a container fill them with solid and liquid and gas will be the container which is completely filled with a gaseous substance why because they can move in all direction and when they can move in all direction they can occupy entire space the distance between the molecule that is gaseous molecule is so large in case of gases comparatively less in liquid and almost negligible in solids 
as we can see over here. 